Hey YouTube, this is Unconnected007, and today I am going to show you how to create a CSS SRCDS server. Um, this is a computer. Uh, I am using TeamViewer, so I can see the screen and control it. Um, that's right next to me. Um, you can host it off your computer, but I do not. I believe you cannot get internet. So, um, what you want to do on your server computer, which is XP for me, is download this HLDS update tool. Link will be in the description. You can also get it off Steam's website. Um, before you open it, sorry, um, you want to go to start and go to my computer. And you want to create a folder called SRCDS. Alright, so you want to right click, new, folder, SRCDS. I already have one called SRCDS, so I'm going to name it SR, or SRCDS2. For this tutorial. Um, now you want to open HLDS update tool, run it, next, you don't need to read all this junk, and click browse. Now you want to browse for your SRCDS, for me it's SRCDS for this tutorial, so you want to double click SRCDS or SRCDS2. Next, next, and it will install SR or part of the server to it. And you want to just go through the setup. It's simple. There's a README on how to do the setup too. So after that, you want to go start my computer. C strike. C drive and then SRCDS or SRCDS2 for me. Okay, you should have only these files in this folder. You just want to check to make sure those are installed on there, and now you can just minimize it. Now you want to go to start and you want to open command prompt. Um, if you can't if you can't find it, just go to run. If no if run isn't on that part of your start menu just go to all programs accessories and then it should be command prompt in there open it and now you what you want to do is go to your C drive and then you want to change directory to your SRCDS folder um, all commands will be in description, so I am showing you how to do it now. I will also have an installation guide on how to do all this. So what you want to do is type change directory, cd, and type c drive. Okay, press enter. And it should be only your c drive. It shouldn't say document settings, the host server, that junk. Um, now you want to type change directory, cd again, and type srcds. SRCDS and it's SRCDS2 for me. Okay, and it should say that you're in that directory now. Now, once you're in that directory, you want to type HLDS update tool space minus command space update space minus game space co or quotation marks counter slash strike space source then quotation mark after that you want to type minus dir dir and then space c slash srcds2 okay that's for me as it wouldn't be srcds2 for you It'd just be srcds you want to press enter and then it will be getting um, it will install the files this can take up to two hours so bear with me and just install it it just went through, it says downloading, and then it says up, um, checking bootstrap version, and now it's updating. No installation record found, so it, all it is is an update that 
is going to basically re -ins or install all the files. It's an update that checks if the files are there to update the server. This is how you update your server if you cannot connect to it, like it says running an older version. So you you just do the same thing that I did here. You just type minus command update minus game counter strike source minus dir c srcds. And this is what it looks like. It goes your percent and it will take a very long time. So I am gonna pause the video. Once it is at a hundred percent, close the command prompt. Okay? So I'm gonna pause it and yeah. Okay, after it's finished installing, you wanna go to start and open your SRCDS2 folder. Okay, C strike. And I have renamed or got rid of the other SRCDS file so it makes it easier on you. So it, they'll just be one SRCDS. Okay, C SRCDS2. You want to open it and it should look like mine. If it doesn't, then I have no idea what went wrong. It should it look exactly like this. Um, what you want to do is open orange box. And now you want to right click SRCDS and create a shortcut of this file. Create shortcut. And it should create a shortcut. Just drag it on the desktop. because I already have it. Now you can close orange box um, folder or SRCDS. You want to right click that shortcut to SRCDS and go to properties. Um, I have a command here. I have copied and pasted it so it makes it easier of what you need to type in here. Um, see SRCDS. Make sure it's SRCDS2 um, or whatever the name of your folder is in your C drive. Um, orange box srcds.exe minus console um, minus game C strike plus map um, map you choose whatever map I just did CS office that's the easiest then do minus max players the max players you want of the server and then space minus auto update link all commands will be in description I am not gonna see your let you copy it because it just makes longer just click apply okay after that double click it and it should come up with this okay um, you name server names name it whatever you want um, I have my map aim texture too so that's what I have um, you choose whatever map I am not going to show you how to install maps you can look it up it's pretty easy and you can choose your max players here and your Archon password. Secure Valve Anti-Cheat, which is VAC. You can turn it on and off, whatever. Click Start Server. You should say Starting Dedicated Server. Shouldn't take too long. Alright, it's already done. And it should come up with a box like this. Um, it shows you how many seconds it's been up. And it shows everything. Um, you want to go to Configure and configure it any way you want um i think it stay it should stay the same so uh, yeah it doesn't i think you have to configure it every time whatever you want um allow flashlight okay all that stuff um so your server is officially up if you go to main and it shows the IP address of the server, do not connect to that IP address. That is your LAN IP address. Um, you need to port forward your um, or route your um, s um, server. So what you want to do, I'm um, going on my computer, is go on your internet and type your go log into your router. So this is what my router looks like. There will be a link in the description on routers on how to route it. Every router is different. You wanna, for me, you want to click advance and then go to gaming. Okay, now you want to select the game, Counter-Strike. Where is it? Select machine, this one. 
that's what it's called. Click save, save settings, and it should be something like this. And now your server is officially um, routed. So what you want to do to find your IP address of an online server is go to start. And go open internet. And what you want to do um, is search what is my IP dot com. I I don't care about sharing this because it's the server. So you want to type what is my IP address, and this will be your server's IP address with just colon two seven zero one five at the end of it. don't want to so what is my IP address my IP address dot com okay so you open this up anyway we're taking forever um, the, on the server, the internet might be slower because it is routed. It might be faster. Um, it's just for Counter-Strike purposes. Okay, there it is. Computer IP address is this right here. So what you want to do is highlight that. Right click. Blah, blah, blah. Copy. Okay, so now um, your server is basically done. Um, Make sure everything's set. It's pretty self-explanatory. And I'm going to minimize the server. And I am going to show you how to access it on Counter-Strike. So I'm going on my computer. Opening Counter-Strike Source. And after um, this tutorial over, there will be another video on how to install SM Admin onto your server. Okay, so you're in Counter Strike. You wanna go to console. If you don't know how to open console, go to options, go to keyboard, go to advanced, click enable developer console, click that key um, underneath your escape key and this should pop up. Um, what you want to do is type connect and then that IP address and at the end of that IP address type 27015. Never connect it to this your server LAN or it messes it up, it messes the um, the disable, I've had this problem, the thing. So as you can see this is my server, I have SM admin, you can see um, my Archon password is test123, Archon say hi. Uh, hello. See, there you go. Um, I have Z-Block on this here too. I will also show you how to do uh, the um, um, so that that's basically it. Um, please rate, subscribe, and comment. Tell me what you think. Um, if it does not work, redo all the steps and ask questions and tell me if it worked for you. So please rate, subscribe, and tell me what you think. And on the next video, um, I will show you how to install SRCDS and ZBlock. Or I'm in mean, uh, SRCDS, SM Admin, and um, um, ZBlock.